Um, sure. Uh, you know, proud of the way we competed tonight. Um, you know, got some big hits, none bigger than Jacob Gerald's Grand Slam early on. That really, uh, you know, helped us separate and expand a lead and play with the lead the rest of the night. Uh, it's a very good team. Uh, you can see why they have the the RPI and the national ranking that they have. They they've earned that, and that's a an extremely dangerous offense that's capable of scoring at, at any time. So for us to use all the pitching that we did and guys pick each other up and uh, outside of the big inning they had there in the middle, uh, but guys just did a good job of turning a couple of big double plays. But I uh, just thought we did a nice job of drawing walks, getting hits, had some big hits, hit a few home runs tonight. Um, but uh, just were able to keep the pressure on and and uh, fortunate to come away with a with a victory because it's a big one. It's a, it's a really good team. This is not only your second win against this team, but uh, your second decisive win. Does, it, does, does this feel kind of like a statement win for you guys? No, I don't think so. I mean, we have, certainly don't look at it that way. I mean, they're a very good team. They're projected to host a regional. And, um, you know, I just feel like we've... Uh, you know, our our uh, our body of work is more the body of work extended over conference play and then taking care of business in the midweek games. And again, we dug ourselves such a hole early on that you know it, it doesn't feel like we have time to look around and say we made a statement here or there. We just need to keep our head down and keep playing hard and keep playing well and keep executing and not really think about what it means. We just need to keep playing good baseball. Anything else? You guys keep finding different ways to win. Is that a, you know, a testament to how well-rounded this team is? You can beat teams in a lot of different ways? It, uh, I think it speaks definitely to the mindset of what, what a confident team looks like with a high level of belief. That enables them to find a way. And when there's doubt and fear, you also find a way. It just comes on the wrong side of things, and we dealt with that. We had to go through that, and that was a tough learning experience for us. Uh, but we went through it, and we came out of it. And, uh, and now we're seeing what the other side looks like and just the belief that good things are going to happen uh, and a lot of trust in each other and a lot of belief in this team, and this is what it looks like. Uh, but we also have to remember that we are earning this through our preparation and through our focus and a disciplined approach and, you know, playing good baseball. So uh, we'll just have to keep earning it every day and just know that, you know, there's still a lot of season left and we still have a lot of work to do. What was the plan for Tristan just go in and hit in or two tonight? Yeah, yeah, it was one or two max. Yeah, it, we knew it was going to be a... A lot of, a lot of guys that were gonna uh, be available tonight. So, you know, we would have had Ammons and Clayton and Garris available, um, but it just worked out. Fortunately, that they didn't need to pitch tonight, but we would have thrown them. Thank you, coach. Thanks, guys. Right, thanks, guys. We have Billy right behind.